name is Beston. I live in Cape Town. Also, I do uh, delivery. Interbed helped me to realize my dreams. Now I have my own delivery vehicle and I'm able to do the removal in and around Cape Town. Hi and welcome to all the racing fans around the globe joining us for this pre-recorded show which is recorded today, Tuesday, for the Wednesday meeting on the 20th of March which will take place at Hollywood Bet Scottsville. Joining me in studio is Devon Govender. Devon, firstly, how are you doing? And secondly, looking at the card, I think quite a few fancy runners will be there. Yes, Sheldon, I'm doing very well. Thanks for asking. Yes, I had a good look at the card and I do believe it could be a, a, a card for favourite backers. Right, let's get straight into the action for race number one. We'll take a look at the betting with number nine, Soho Star. The Wada Winter currently at 18 to 10 from the Yogas Governor's Stable after running second to China Berry on debut with excuses. Number seven, Cat's Pajamas. Positive comments from Frank Robinson, that is 33 to 10 from 4 to 1. And then number 10, New Frontier is trading at 7 to 2. Now let's get straight with number 9, Soho Star. First time out was at Scottsville over 1,200 metres. A cracking second, despite going off at 66 to 1. Devon, just with that natural improvement from the first run to the second run, I think this could be the right horse on the card. Yeah, definitely has uh, has to have a massive uh, winning chance. Will have come on after that uh, decent debut effort, <clears throat> finishing second, 0 0.3 lengths behind the winner on that occasion. But I am a little bit cautious because did go off at long odds on debut, so was unfancied on debut. I wouldn't be going head on and taking that uh, 18 to 10. I'll keep a close eye on some of the first timers, especially number seven, Cat's Pajamas, who's extremely well bred. Yes, looking at number seven, Cat's Pajamas, Frank Robinson, we know who for that stable. They do exceptionally well with their babies and they got a conveyor belt of good horses. The comments are very positive. And then you throw in number 10, New Frontier from the Paul Lafferty stable. And he also said a horse with a future throw into all calculations. So the two first timers, they'll be the main dangers. Yes, in fact, I'm going to lead narrowly towards number seven, uh, Cat's Pajamas, in a very, very tricky contest. Then number 10, New Frontier, followed by number nine, Soho Star. Well, that's a look at race number one at Hollywood Bet Scottsville. Watch them go down to the start and watch where the race time money comes. At this stage, number nine, Soho Star with the run under the belt, running second to China Berry. That's the horse they have to beat, but the unraised horses keep a close eye on the market. good fun days like these are, are great you get the whole industry together um, and to have you know companies um, and corporations like Interbet and Cape Racing who are uh, so generous with um, sort of time and, um, and energy into into making a day like this possible is uh, it's it's fantastic for everyone mm -hmm. 